this is the project that we will be doing today. I made a spring centerpiece. These are all made with the flowers and ribbon and container all from the Dollar Tree. It's very quick and easy to make and the results I think it uh, does not look like something that you would get from the Dollar Tree. That's the best part. Hi and welcome back to Rebecca's Place. I'm Rebecca and this here is Dakota. This is our family pet. Um, Dakota is actually my daughter's little pup, but she is the family pet. <laughs> um, my husband and I get to spend a lot of time with her um, because of my daughter's school hours and work. Um, today, we're gonna make a bouquet and I'm gonna show you some of the items that you're gonna need. And there goes Dakota already. Okay, this here, all these items are from the Dollar Tree. I already went ahead and spray painted this. This is the silver one. It just says flower and garden. And I used the Krylon chalky finish paint again. It's in classic white. You can get so many uses out of just the one can. This is full and I've already used it on a few projects. So you need this, paint it white, and we're gonna sand it down a little. So we need some sandpaper. I have the, um, this here, um, styrofoam for the flowers. It comes in four pieces, but what I'm gonna do is just glue all four of these together. And then that's gonna be in our base here. Uh, you'll need the wire cutters, ribbon, I have several, I'm not really sure until I get there, but I'm definitely gonna have the burlap. Um, I wanna have some purple and uh, some white. And then the flowers, we got the um, tiger lilies and I have the uh, violet pansies. I got several of these. And I never do pronounce this correctly, but uh, Amaranthus, I love these. We'll have the um, glue gun, and then we're ready to get started. Okay, so I went ahead and glued all four of those together, and then just for some stability, I also glued it to the bottom inside here. Um, as I said, you'd need some sandpaper. So as you can see how nice it looks when you just kind of rough it up, it gives it kind of that old tiny distressed one out. That's it. And then just you know, a little bit here and there. See? And then we'll do the same on this side so it'll make those letters show up. start arranging these in here. Your um, center flower, they always say it should stand up a little higher than your others. And then I'm just going to build the others around here. So on the sides, these are going to go in a little bit more. sure that I kind of spread all the colors about. That's what makes it look so pretty. I like the pansies with these tire 
excuse me, these tiger lilies because they blended in so pretty together because they um, are purple. And you'll find that as you get to know me, purple is my favorite color. Okay. favorite. I actually had bought a book, still have it, that um, cross stitch uh, and it was all these different patterns for um, patterns to cross stitch uh, pansy prints. So who knows, maybe I'll still get around to that. Okay, put this on this side. Okay. As you can see so far, they're filling in nice, but we have a lot of flowers to put in here. And again, just make sure you're scattering colors all about as you put those in. Now these, I'll probably put these in last. Just want to make sure I get this all filled in with the pansies first. And just put a pop of yellow here and there. that just peek out here so I might have to cut some of them back a little bit to do that so I'll just cut these down a little bit shorter okay here's where we've progressed to so far this is just me kind of tilting it over but now in here where you see the little kind of openings, there'll be some bows that are going to go to fill in. And then I still have this to put throughout. Well, Dakota came back. <laughs> yeah, you want to say hi? Dakota, look over here. Look there. Say hi. <laughs> okay. You don't mind being on camera at all, do you? Hmm? Say, I don't mind being on camera at all. Yeah, you're such a sweet girl. Hmm? <laughs> okay. <laughs> So here we are guys with the finished project. I think it turned out pretty nice. I just love the colors of the pansies. This is just the top side of it. you like it and uh, 
I also hope that if you're not subscribed yet, that you will subscribe and hit that like button. And also if you tap the bell each time I upload a new video, you will uh, be notified. I sincerely appreciate everyone taking the time and please come back.